Implicit Differentiation, Part 1 Implicit differentiation is used when it's not possible or difficult to solve for the independent variable. For example, find dy dx if x to the third power minus y to the third power equals y. It wouldn't be very easy to solve for y in this case, so what we're going to do is we're going to differentiate each term independently or individually uh, with respect to x. And I can uh, take x to the third power and it becomes uh, 3x squared and then minus y to the third power and we have to employ the chain rule here so it becomes 3y squared but times dy dx and of course the derivative of just y is dy dx. The next thing we need to do is get all the dy dx terms on one side which we do right here and then we need to further isolate the dy dx term because that's what we're trying to solve for so I factor it out of the expression and I have dy dx times 1 plus 3y squared. The last thing I'm going to do is divide both sides of the equation by 1 plus 3y squared and when I do that I have step 4 here and uh, I end up with this expression or uh, a little more uh, uh, formally here we have uh, dy dx equals 3x squared over 1 plus 3y squared. Notice that uh, this derivative is both x and y dependent. So if I'm going to find uh, the, the derivative of the uh, this relation here at a point I'm going to have to know both the x and y component.